Carlos Nelson with Cascade Sports. We're here at William Christman High School, where William Christman just played a team out of Oklahoma and got the win. Who do we have here? Uh, Marcus Wigfall, hey, senior guard. Tell, tell our audience a little bit about yourself. What position you play, how long you've been playing, and what grade you uh, I'm a senior, uh, playing shooting guard. I've been playing since uh, fourth grade, but I've been playing varsity since uh, freshman year. All right, run it down real quick and give the coaches that you played over the years, your bitty coaches, uh, and the teams that help you get your skill set to where it's at right now. Give them their props. Uh, I want to thank A.B. Lennox and Betty Lennox. I used to play for them. And then also I want to take, uh, thank, take the time to thank the Pacers organization. I played with them over this summer and uh, really improved my game. Uh, you've been playing uh, all four years at William Christman. Run your freshman year down. Uh, my freshman year, I started off on the sophomore team, and I worked my way up to JV, and then, like, the last, I think, six games, I ended up playing varsity. All right. Uh, your junior, your, your sophomore year, run that down. Uh, my sophomore year, we went uh, 11 and 19, I think, and that was a little better than the previous year. Six and we went six. Your personal six season. Games. Uh, personally, I did pretty good sophomore year. Uh, I started most of the season. And, uh, yeah, we play hard. Your junior season, run it down. Uh, junior season was great. Uh, it was probably the best season uh, Christman has seen. And I did pretty well. I started all season, and uh, we finished 20-9, and nine and we lost uh, by oh, in what, overtime. What, what goals do you have for yourself this season? Uh, this season I want to be able to shoot the three very well. I want to be able to uh, make an impact on defense and rebound. Uh, with Cascade Sports being home and a student athlete, how important is your education? Education is very important. Uh, I got to stay on top of my grades to make sure I got to do what I got to do. Uh, who's been an influence or uh, mentor to you off the court in your uh, personal life? In my personal life, uh, one of my, our mentors is our athletic director. He's been a big role in my and, life. And, and what's his name? Uh, Greg McGee. Hey, Mr. McGee, shout out from the baby boy. Anybody else? Uh, and then just my family supporting me oh, every game. They don't know who your family is. Hey, run, uh, run the names down. Dina Wigfall and my dad, Clint Wigfall, my little brother, Jenny hey, Wigfall. Hey, dad, big boy shouting out at you. Baby baby brother, big boy shouting out at you. Uh, how did you feel you performed tonight? I didn't feel I performed as good as I could, but I played hard and I ended up fouling out. But hey, our, my team picked us up and we got the dub. How, how, uh, did you think you was going to get that win? Yes, I, I always believe we're going to win. Excellent. Whatever, man. Uh, whatever. Who we have here? Oh, uh, we have Antonio Rodriguez. Run it down, Rodriguez. Yeah. Get in the frame, baby got boy. You, I got you, I got uh, you. Run it down your uh, basketball career from the time you opened up your eyes. Oh, uh, <laughs> I've been playing actually since fifth grade. I used to play for middle school all the time in elementary, and I'm a junior. And what coaches you want to give them their props to uh, help you get where you at? I want to thank uh, Coach Cates and the rest of the coaches, Daniels, everybody. And they're just like helping me and keeping me on track, like during the classroom and stuff like that. How, 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 how important is that education? Oh, uh, it's very important, like when you have a, like, you uh, have a goal to make What goals like. have you set for yourself this season? Oh, uh, I want to be able to uh, drive and kick more, because that's something that the coaches want out of me. Uh, what grade do you say you in? I'm a junior. You're a junior, yeah. so uh, you got another season here. Yeah, yeah. Uh, with uh, this win tonight, how do you feel about that, and how do you feel you played tonight? I felt like I played pretty good on the defensive end. I could have shot the ball a little more, a little better. Uh, uh, one to ten, what's your handles like? Uh, probably like a seven or eight. I don't know. Bro, bro, bro got a seven more. He got a six. Come on, run it down. He, he got a seven. He, he got, got a. Seven. Oh, you you co-signing on the brother? <laughs> All right. Uh, on a one to ten, what's your shot like? On a good day, probably a eight. All right. Eight. What would you consider the best part of your game? Probably my shooting and hey, my passing. How, how you like it here with? It's different. It's like I like it. This is like a lot of more moving and passing and stuff like that. Shout out to anybody? Uh, I want to shout out my mom and my dad for always I being there. Who are they? Who are they? Uh, Tony Rodriguez and Sanji uh, De La Cruz. Hey, hey, the Rodriguez's and the Cruz's, shout out from the baby boy. All right, well, it was a pleasure having you on the show, and we look forward to covering one or two more of your games before the season's out.
This is brought to you by Glenite Construction Services, leader in training environmental and construction services. www.glenightconstruction.com